going to draw my right angled isosceles triangle here. There we go. That is equal to that. And then the sum of the areas of the squares equal 72 in total. Now, they're isosceles triangles, so this is x, this is x, and I'll call this y. Well, there's two thing, two pieces of information we now have. We know that x squared plus x squared is equal to y squared from Pythagoras' theorem, hence 2x squared is equal to y squared. And we also know that the sum of the squares in total, so that is going to be 2x squared plus y squared. Yeah, the sum of the uh, areas of the squares is equal to 72. So I can now just replace this y squared by this y squared and hence 2x squared. 4x squared is going to equal 72. I want to find x and y, remember, so I can find the area. And that means x squared, I can divide by 2, 36, divide by 2 again, x squared is going to be 18. And actually, that means we're pretty much there. We don't need, even need to find y. The area is going to be a half times x times x. So it's going to be 9.